Hi, what's up? How you doing? Yeah, my hair's a little, it's Saturday, June 13th. Check out my shirt. <laughs> it says, I survived coronavirus. Everybody who has seen it, has had like the same reaction. Ha ha ha, and yeah, so far. <laughs> like, hey, first off, not cool. I'm gonna survive. <laughs> Second off, you know, I figure I feel pretty fit as a fiddle. And so for academic purposes, lately, for a while, I've been, I've been trying to get it, throw myself into the <sighs> blasting stream of COVID-19. And I can't get it. So, I mean, point is, the point is, I'm going to go a different direction with this and then come back. I'm going to loop around, okay? I'm going to loop back around. Today, I was talking with my papa about the times I've done. Stand-up comedy. And he's like, yeah, you should do it again. I'm like, yeah, I should do it again. Because I've been feeling it too. But then I was like, oh man. Can't, where can you do it? <laughs> right now, uh, do you, they have to be like half capacity? Like, uh, do I have to wear a mask? It would be hard to do stand-up comedy in a mask. Unless you could incorporate it into the act somehow. I bought a mask on Amazon. Uh, just in case like I was ever get in a mall or something and they're like, you can't come in here with a mask. But it was kind of like a smart ass mask. It was like a sub-zero mask. And there's like a nose hole in it and stuff. So I'm like, I don't know. If they would let me in. It's basically like, you can't come in here unless you're looking like a terrorist, but like, or a doctor. Um, or somebody in Asia in the 90s, or Michael Jackson. It's not like people have never done this. It's not like it's ever worked either. Anyways, if I could get a Bane mask, like from Dark Knight Rises, I would wear that all the time, as long as I could breathe good in it. You know, a lot of these, I don't like wearing a mask because I'm just like, I can't, I can't breathe good. And like, I can't even get COVID trying as hard as I can. I think the riots kind of uh, threw everybody off of COVID. But now they feel conflicted like, but I should still be caring about COVID. But I feel anxious ab about what's going on. With, like, dude. We might go to a movie tonight. Yeah, because theaters are back open. Movies aren't out. So we might it might have to be just The Dark Knight. But I love going to The Dark Knight in theaters. And for a chance to do that again, I will jump at that. So, yeah. Interesting times indeed, I, I say. How about all of you? How do you all feel? I mean, I just really like... I'm not, I'm not against the police, like, you know, toning it down a bit. 
I can feel that. Like, you know, within like any negotiation, both sides want a lot more than they're gonna get, but hopefully both sides make some concessions. And hey, I don't mind living out here in the middle of nowhere Idaho right now. Like, cause there's just nothing to get riled up about around here. You can't, as people are, if people, if, if people tried to have a riot, it would fizzle out. It, nobody would. People pick up litter here, okay? Yeah, right? <laughs> like, um, nobody's gonna like topple trash cans because then somebody else would come be and just be like, please, they'll pick it up. Like, let's, let's not make a mess. No reason we can't be civil, right? And uh, it's weird because, okay, the society around here is that polite that a riot just would not happen. And yet, these folks come from strong pioneer stock. If there were outside agitators uh, trying to raise a ruckus, I really don't know what would happen then. Really, I just think like, it was what I, they would like try to start a ruckus. They're trying to, uh, they're toppling trash cans or whatever, breaking the star window. People would just be like, looking on like, it, like, what are you doing? Somebody called the cops. And people would just be like watching like, and nobody would be like joining in. And people be like, ah, and then I did, yeah, I think it would be, cause you couldn't get, you couldn't get a riot going here cause you couldn't get people that all jacked up. They'd be like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Dude, we're getting little Caesars. Um, we just want to get some little Caesars and a red box. Please stop. Don't break Walgreens window, damn it. I go to Walgreens. It's the only damn Walgreens in town, bitch. Ah, oh, see, you know. Nobody wants to riot in a small town because, you know, you just barely got your second McDonald's. You don't want to push it. So. Yeah, that's all. It just needs to chill. I hope people chill enough that I can get back on stage and do some comedy. That'd be great. Thank you for watching, anybody. And sub there's some new subscribers. Hooray. Thank you. All right. Cool, cool. Hope you're having a great Saturday. Peace out.